Great pictures. You know, that's my mama in that picture. That's your mom? Yeah, yeah, she went on uh, a trip to Mississippi with me. I have to take friends with me to keep all this food from going to waste. That's Morgan's mom right there. Yeah. All right, so what did she do while she was with you? She well, she her, ate. her way. <laughs> yeah. What a great gig. Uh, it's a tough job, but somebody has to do it, Howard. What makes Southern food so special? What is it about it? Well, I joke that my favorite four Southern food groups are bourbon, salt, bacon, and pie. But really, the South is a collision of all kind of culinary uh, histories, like African and Caribbean mm -hmm. and Mexican and English and French and Spanish, and it all kind of comes together in the South, and we put our own twist on it. But that's what makes the region so unique and so diverse. I think the personality of those who are cooking at the TLC that's added to the recipe is well, really so key. Yeah, everything is made with love, especially things like banana pudding and chicken fried steak and oh. that kind of thing. I and mean, it's and it's healthy for you, right? Oh yeah, I mean, bananas are fruit. <laughs> That's right. It's considered actually this banana pudding from Nikki's West is considered a vegetable when you order it. Oh, perfect! It. And good so side is mac and cheese. Yeah, well, yeah uh, that's, that's that's good. I saw you were at the Bubble Room. I love the love bubble the room. place. The Bubble yeah. Scouts. Uh, cake, Fun place. Cake there is an entire food group with a itself. steak knife in the top of each piece. Yeah, small little pieces at the Bubble Room. Really, they're like the size of of Buicks. They're huge. So if you haven't been to the Bubble Room, or if you haven't been to most of the places in this book. You should try at least to eat your way through the country by trying the recipes in the book. Everyone in our test kitchen has been tested again, and they are just amazing. So give it a shot.